What is up, party people? MTG next door, this is Stitch. This is coming for y'all. I'm just letting you know. You will be saying, thank you, sir, may I have another? Because I'm playing on cards in every single Zoom video we have to do until we can play in person again. Goddamn COVID. Got the packs, let's get to it. Get your asses off screen. Uh, I just did a video with TB, uh, opened up some Commander Legends, and uh, wow, is that cat equipped to start making some crazy packs. Uh, here we go. We're, I'm sorry, we're opening, <laughs> I'm sorry, we are opening um, Crimson Cold Cuts. So uh, we got six packs. Uh, this is the second video off the box. Maybe a list card. Who knows? Do I cut it? No, I'm done cutting cards. Oh, look, it's this guy. That's it. There you are. Otter before fraternity party, right there. And I made a nice little fingerprint on it. There, there. Who are you? Oh, it's Dracula. So maybe there's a Dracula card in this pack. Unlikely. Um, I don't think anyone's opening the Dracula stuff. There's your planes. Look at that. It's like a Wrath of God planes. I love it. I love these black and white artworks. Uh, there's a good chance I'm going to go out and buy a shit ton of these, or maybe just another box instead of buying a land. Repository scab. Um, I'll stop at the stuff that, oh, look at this. Stitch assistant. What do you do? It says stitch in it, so I'm going to read the card. Uh, two and a blue for a zombie 3-2 exploit. So you got a sack of creature. When exploit your creature, scry one, then draw a card. Eh, okay, sorry I stopped. Wretched Thong again. I gotta make a, make a, make a, so this is our first party person right there. Otter, you were first to the party. You usually were, and you were usually the first that we had to drag to the couch. Uh, Estwald, Shield, blah, 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 Markov Retribution. Skulking Killer. Oh, okay, there she is. Just waiting for me. And then she's gonna pour paint all over my car. Thank you, Emily, you dick. That's what we're doing here. We are recounting our college days because this is this is basically the college party set. Vampires, Vengeance. Oh, we're in the uncommons. I, I didn't even so read the uncommons. I just just called Emily a bitch. Uh, Skulking Killer, uh, three and a black for a vampire assassin four two. When it is a battlefield target creature and opponent, nope. Uh, Vampire's Vengeance, two and a red for an instant. Uh, it deals two damage, he's non-vampire creature, and then create a blood token. Don't hate that. Not entirely terrible. Uh, yes, I did just wipe dog hair off my hand. I was petting Marcy, she's sitting next to me. Just go pound sand. And we've got an uncommon, uh, there she is, wedding security. Yes, you can absolutely go to the party, because you're going to defend us from people who look like you. <laughs> so three black black for four four soldier vampire when attacked you may sacrifice a blood token and then put a one one counter on wedding security and draw a card so there's a use for those awful blood token artifacts uh yeah i don't know i might be playing that we got a common there she is blood craze socialite doc and i have both decided to fight over this one even though she has bad hair eating people's eyes and is covered in blood we still want you uh, what do we got here? We got a rare. It is a 1-1 one, one something. Hamlet Vanguard. You're, you're in the party. Don't worry. Hamlet Vanguard. Two and a green for a human warrior with Ward 2. I still I have not seen Ward played effectively in our format, but whatever. Uh, it enters the battlefield with two 1-1 one, one counters on each on it for each other non-token human you control. All right, so a human thing. Carl, 25 cents. Huh? Yeah. What else are we getting? We got a rare foil. And it's two color. Oh, be a land. Be a, oh, it, it is. <laughs> it is a storm carved coast in the foil full art. Would you look at that? That is our foil for the box, and I am not mad at that. I'm mad at foils because they curl. But uh, it, it enters the battlefield tapped unless you control two or more of the lands. Beautiful. Uh, value this sucker up. Please be like 10 bucks. I would break my heart if the blue, red, full art foil uh, land was not, or showcase, whatever they call this shit. Uh, and then no token, we've got a uh, puzzle card. So there's that. Let's shove the knife into yet another pack. 
destroy some non-biodegradable. There we go. It's teasing us again. Destroy some non-biodegradable. I'm sorry, non-recyclable wrappers. Come on, wizards, get it together. What do we got? We've got a flying dead person with a sword. If you're dead, why do you need a sword? I don't know. What card is this? Dorothea, vengeful victim. Oh, she needs a sword because she's pissed off. Uh, there it is again. Oh, please. Every pack needs to have this plane, the Wrath of God planes in it. I love it. Uh, there's your throng again. Uh, another one of these. Uh, Alchemist Retrieval. Cleave. One, I don't know what cleave... Oh, cleave means remove the bracket shit. So, return target permanent to its owner's hand. So, blah. Cruel Witness. Reclusive Taxidermist. We've seen you before. Uncommon. Don't like you, Manadork. Screaming Swarm. I think Mr. Pink commented on this last night. Look at the art on that. That is a face only another screaming swarm bird horror could love. If you've got light coming out of your mouth, something's wrong. <clears throat> and we got a kindly ancestor. I think we saw that already. Uncommon again. Panic bystander. Ugh, Doc got you last night, but I still I didn't get it. So one or white for a human peasant 2-2. Two -two. When it or another creature you control dies, you gain one life. Okay, at the beginning of your end step, if you gain three or more life this turn, transform human panic bystander. So either three things have to die or you have to be in a life gain situation. Look at the damage on the top of that card. That is great. Thank you for sorting these. Cackling culprit. Oh, look at this psychopath. Oh, he's got buckets full of human parts. Well, that's what you did with your life. When it or another creature you control dies, you gain one life. It, uh, and for one or black, cackling, so you got to be in white black. Cackling culprit gains death touch until end of turn. Nope, not doing that. And then we've got another uncommon, wedding security again, but you're already there. But we don't need more security because you're totally awesome. And we got a rare 4-4. Four, four. What are you? Oh, it's Dorothea. There we go. Look. Oh, the sorting. Oh, they're still doing it, folks. They're still doing it. I got the Dorothea in the Dorothea. Uh, I, I would say, like, what are the odds? The odds are probably ridiculous. And this is just proof that these packs, these set boosters are not sorted. Dorothea, what do you do, my dear? White blue for 4-4 four, four spirit. Okay, that seems odd. Legendary, be your commander. Flying when it uh, attacks or blocks, sacrifice it at the end of combat. So when it does anything, sack it. And then you gotta play it out of the yard for disturb, and then what happens now? Enchant creature, and it has, whenever this creature attacks, create a 4-4 white spirit token creature with flying that's tapping attacking. Sacrifice a token at the end of combat. Okay. Yeah, and if it would be, yeah, it's so it's gone if it goes to the yard. I don't know. I don't know. Carl, show me the Dorothea love. You got a common foil because that's what we get on this Chanel. And did we get a list card? We did. Look, see the little symbol over there? That means you pulled a crappy list card. What did I get? Sleeping potion. What the fuck? Uh, when it, and it, when it comes into play, I like how they didn't change the text. <clears throat> when it comes into play, tap enchanted creature. Doesn't untap during its controls. Untap, tap. When it becomes the target of the spell or ability, sacrifice sleeping potion. So if you zap the fucker, it wakes him up. Because he's drunk. You get to go to the party. You belong there. Alright, fix you. If you're going to hang out at the party, you can't be, like, keeled over. I spit on you. I'm sorry. Alright. Pack, what number is this? Three? Pack three. There we go. Another list card or a puzzle card. That's where we're at. Let's turn it over and see what we get. Hello. Oh boy. This is a big mess. This is a big, big mess right here. I mean, I love that you're dancing with drinking hand. Look, you're spilling a little. You're spilling a little. I'm not judging you. Wait, what? Oh yeah, of course I can dance. I can, I can do that too. No, I'm not doing that. Wait, stop. <laughs> what are you guys? Falcon Rift Celebrants. Uh, I don't know if that's a special art, but you are in the party for sure. There we go. Wow, look at this. This is crazy. 
That is our third, I'm sorry, I know I'm going through these pretty fast, but, uh, yep, another one. That is our third, I wished for it and it happened. I, I'm not making this up. This is our third uh, Wrath of God planes. This is great. Uh, Blood Fountain, we've done. There they are, the thing of the thing. Don't talk to me about sorting. There it is right there. But I think I want the full art at the party because there's more, right? It's sort of. And look, uh-oh, we got, oh, I can't wait to read that. <laughs> Holy shit. Four and a red for a four-four vampire with menace. When it enters the battlefield, create two blood tokens. Why not? Why not? God, I wish there was flavor text on this. Oh, and then we got this. What are you doing but showing off, gluttonous guest? Ah, gluttonous guest. Folks, there will never be another set like this ever again. Probably, I don't know. But look at this. I mean, and, and I mean, hello. And these two back here, these two nobodies, they're not even paying attention to her. I'm scoping this out. I'm over at the side saying like, hey, what's going on? I like the glasses you got. I can't see how you put that on a table, but whatever. It looks like you're not sitting down anytime soon. I'm a terrible person, people. <laughs> Because all I'm thinking about is <laughs> When gluttonous guest enters the battlefield, create a blood token. And when you sack a blood token, gain a life. Yeah. But you're at the party. And I want to cover the girls up. They're dancing their lives away. Oh, here we go. Good lord. We're running the gamut here. Look at this shit. Belligerent guest. Two and a red for a vampire with trample. Of course it has trample, bruh. 3-2, when it deals combat damage to a player, create a blood token. We're all about, we're, we are all in. Look what she did. The wine ran out. Well, fuck you. I'm destroying it. Because that's what I did. Because I got here early. Holy shit. Uncommon. Uh, our party's already bigger than last time, I think. Uh, Hero's Downfall, we've seen you. Uh, Markov, Retribution, I think last pack, maybe. And yep, Skull can kill her again. And what we got? We got Common here. Oh, the Desperate Farmer. Dude, they did this. They did it. Oh, man. Uh, we got an Uncommon. Oh, what is happening in this pack? Blood Hypnotist. Two and a red. It can't block. It's a 3-3. Three, three. Whenever you sacrifice one or more blood tokens, target creature can't block this turn. Your ability triggers only once each turn. So, yeah, no, I'm not buying that. But uh, do I want to? I, eh, yeah, I guess. You got to go to the party. We got a rare. What do we get? Voldarian Estate. Okay, you're at the party. I'm not covering up the belligerent guest here, though. Voldarian Estate is, uh, is this the to uh, is this the Dracula's Castle thing? Uh, tap it to add colorless, pay one life, add man one mana of any color, spend this mana only to cast a vampire spell. And then five tap, create a blood token. It costs one less to activate for each vampire you control. Oh boy, Carl, help me out, brother. <clears throat> we got a foil rare, okay. Hive Heart Shaman. I can barely read it. Three and a green for a three five human shaman. Or shaman if you're an aristocrat. Uh, whenever it attacks, you may search your library for a basic land card that doesn't share a land type with a land you control. Put that card on the battlefield, then shuffle. Well, if I'm in humans, uh, we st yeah, we talked about this last night. Five and green. Create a 1-1 one, one green insect creature token. Put a X-1-1 one, one counters on it. Where X is the number of basic... Yeah, no. Uh, foil nothing. Oi. Uh, and then we've got this, Perpetual Time... Oh, this is our list card. Wow, I just did that, didn't I? Uh, two for a Perpetual Time piece. It is a Kaldheim, right? Kaldheim? Uh, uncommon. Tap, put two. Put the top two cards in your grave, library in your graveyard. Uh, and then two, Exile Perpetual Time piece. Shuffle any number of target cards from your graveyard into your library. Uh, you don't get to come to the party. Mainly because the party is going out of control at this point. There we go. Look at this. Listy, listy. Not likely. We pull way too many of the puzzle cards. We got 
This is uh, three. Whoa, what is happening here? Look at that. That is some weird 70s movie poster psychedelic artwork if I've ever seen it. Love it. What are you? Gift of Fangs. Okay. Ah, oh, we broke the cycle. We got a foil island. I don't know what the fuck's going on in that picture. Evolving Wilds. There you go. New art, new set. How many times has that been painted? Lightning Wolf. Hungry Ridge Wolf. We're wolf decking it. And we're into the uncommons. Blood Hypnotist. We're back in vampires. Two and a red for a vampire 3-3. Three, three. It can't block. Whenever you sacrifice one or more blood tokens, target creature can't block this, tur this turn. It triggers once each turn. Are you at the party? No, I think you're... Nah, you might be. You're just screwing with the party guests. Yeah, we'll put you at the party. Why not? Markov Waltzer. Well, of course you're at the party, brah. Two red... White for a 1-3 vampire with flying and haste. At the beginning of combat on your turn, up to two target creatures you control get 1-0 until end of turn. He says, I'll lead. Hello. Yes, you're at the party. Wow, the party's about to get out of control. Uh, hook Hand Mariner, not reading you again. Uh, Restless Bloodseeker. Oh, God. This guy started the party way too early. Look at him. He's touching his nose, which means he's not it. So, uh, at the beginning of your end step, if you gain life this turn, create a blood token. Sack two blood tokens, transform this card, activate only as a three, as th only as three, only as a sorcery. What is this over here? I don't know. I don't know how to play magic, folks. Uh, so let's say you have the stupid blood, blood tokens and you make blood-soaked reveler. There it is. There it is, y'all. Look at the mess he made. Wow. Uh, so it's a 3-3 vampire at the beginning of your end step. If you gain life this turn, create a blood token. And then four and a black for each opponent loses two life and you gain two life. Huh. Don't know. You're at the party. This thing is officially out of control. What do we got? Uh, Epicure, you're in here somewhere, right? Nope, not yet. Nope. Okay. Welcome to the party, Epicure. We got a rare... Oh, wow. Did we just pull that again? Yeah, look at that. We just pulled the non-full art, non-foil uh, Storm Carved Coast. So, okay, that's just how it works, uh, Carl. Not mad, except I would have liked another dual land other than that. And, oh, we did get a list card. What do we got? It's an O2, so that can't be good. Wall of Blood. Oh, oh. Yeah, pay one life, Wall of Blood gets 1-1 one, one until end of turn. Uh, I have seen decks where they use this to absolutely go bonkers infinite. Uh, I'm not doing it. Not my thing. Let's do it. Two packs to go. I don't know what we're at. at the Netherless card. Maybe. What did we get here? We got this thing. I, I have no words. What are you? Cemetery protector. Why do you need to protect a cemetery? I don't know. In Innistrad, maybe that's a thing. Uh, another island. Heron blessed geist. Seen you. Seen you. Seen you. There's the screaming swarm again. And we're in the uncommons. Oh, I took someone out of the party. You don't get to leave. Till you're dead, dude. Uh, vile spawn spider. What is happening in that artwork? Can't tell. Uh, green, blue for 2-3, reach at the beginning of your repeat, mill a card, and then two, green, blue for tap, sack it, create a 1-1 one, one inch, or blah, 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 nope, not doing that. Ballista Watcher, uh, it's a 4-3 four, for 4, uh, two, red, tap it, it deals one damage to any target. And on the butt, two, tap it, it deals one damage, damage to any target, and... And the creatures can't block. And I suppose all werewolves are walking around with that thing. Oh, boy. Got a common blood petal celebrant. Wow. This party just went viral and epic. Uh, first strike. I'm not reading it. It's common. But you're at the party. You're at the party. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Gluttonous guest showed up. Are you not in here already? We got... The oh, there you are. There you are. Gluttonous guest... I'm sorry, she's more my type. Ugh. And we got a rare in the weird frame. Uh, Geralt, Visionary Stitcher. Two and a blue for a 1-4. Uh, zombies you control have flying. 
That's new. Okay, uh, I'm listening. Blue in a tap, sacrifice another non-token creature, create an XX blue zombie creature token where X is this, the sacrifice creature's toughness. Hmm, 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 hmm. Don't know. Carl. <laughs> yeah, I don't know where to go with that. Uh, another rare. It's a two rare pack. Wedding announcement. Oh, look, don't they seem happy? They're crying. Why aren't they crying blood? Sorry, everyone's a critic. Two and a white for an enchantment. At the beginning of your end step, put an invitation counter on wedding announcement. If you attack with two or more creatures this turn, draw a card. Otherwise, create a 1-1 one, one human creature token. Then if wedding announcement has three or more invitation counters on it, transform it. I'm lost in all that. Let's just see what the butt says. Wedding festivity. Creatures you control get 1-1. One, one. Okay. All right. And we got a Honored Heirloom foil and... Nope. No this card. All right. Last pack. This party's out of control. Let's do this. Another list card. <laughs> oh, I'm getting so tired of this. Uh, I know Doc spoils them. There's got to be some way to... Nah, never mind. Oh, ho, 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 ho. All right, now it's a party. Now it's a party. These are the Falcon Rest Celebrants. You're in here already, right? Please say you are. No? Now it's a party. I think we've got everyone from the wedding right here, including this guy who's passed out. Very happy. Uh, another planes, not the one, but you know, foil. Reckless Impulse. Uh, exile the top two cards of your library until now. now. Ancestral Anger, Bloody Betrayal, uh, that's just a take a creature thing. Ceremonial Knife, that's probably a party thing, but you're not a guest, you're just a thing. Uh, equipped Creature gets 1-0 and has whenever this creature deals combat damage, make a blood token. So that's for this set and this set only. So y'all get out of here, you don't belong at this absolute disaster mess. Uh, Lantern of the Lost, 1, uh, when it enters the battlefield, exile target card from graveyard, okay. Uh, one tap, exile the lantern, and exile all cards from all graveyards. Then draw a card. That's going to see some play. Uh, lunar re Rejection. Okay. Cleave, three, and a blue. Return target creature to its owner's hand. No. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Runebound Wolf, we've seen you. We got a common. Okay. There we go. There's your sorting, sorting, sorting. But there's so many of these. It's odds are it's going to come up. Got another common, Blood Craze Socialite again. Uh, I, I have to say that I, I'm not mad at the amount of reprints of these because, you know, hey, pretty. Uh, we got a Mythic. There we go. A 1-2 Mythic. What can you be? Savior of Olenbrock. Brolenbach. One white white for 1-2. Training. Whenever this creature attacks with another creature with power with greater power, put a 1-1 one, one counter on this creature. Okay. Huh. Whenever it trains, exile up to one other target creature from a battlefield or a creature card from the graveyard. When it leaves the battlefield, put the exile cards onto the battlefield under their owner's control. Uh, do it, Carl. Not thrilled. And we got a foil rare again. Wow, okay. So there's more rares in this box, in the foil, than I want. Mirror Hill Mimic. What? And, and look at that. Just because I always do this, you can see them. Look at the roller marks. Oh, God. This just crushes me. Not for me, because I don't trade my cards. But for the people who really want good quality cards, that sucks. Uh, three and a blue for a creature spirit. You may have Mirror Hill Mimic enter the battlefield as a copy of any creature on the battlefield, except it's a spirit in addition to its other type, and you could do that from the graveyard for one more blue. Okay, Carl. Uh, and another rare. It's a three rare, it's a mythic rare, rare pack. Oh, it's, oh, wow, here we go. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> it is a Blood Moon reprint. Damn, that's going to outvalue anything I just pulled. Uh, two and a red, non-basic lands are mountains. We just trashed the entire game with this. 
TV, if you don't know Blood Moon, you do now. Um, I believe I have more of these than I need, uh, so trade block probably. Uh, Carl, what's the list card Blood Moon going for? Holy hell. So let's see what we got. Well, let's, let's, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen ga guests at the party. Way too many people than I want in my house at any given time. But uh, yeah, so let's look at what we pulled here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, six packs, eleven rares, and mythics. Only one mythic, I think. Yeah, only one mythic. Uh, but some of these were really, really nice. Um, let's do the hands and get out of here. Carl, show me what we had for these packs on top and total on the bottom. There you go. MTG next door. I'm out.